The implementation of some clauses in the controversial Security Law Act was today suspended temporarily by the High Court pending hearing and determination of a case filed by the opposition. In his ruling, Justice George Odunga said that the clauses touch on fundamental issues in the Bill of Rights. The following report has more details. Justice George Odunga ruled that the clauses touching on Bill of Rights should be suspended until a legal challenge filed by the opposition is heard. The Coalition for Reforms and Democracy has welcomed the move by the High Court to suspend some clauses in the new Security Act. President Uhuru Kenyatta signed the controversial law last month after it was passed in a chaotic session of parliament over objections that it violates basic human rights. The amendments in the act grant police greater power to investigate and detain terror suspects. The law also imposes strict rules on how the media should report on security matters. Please be seated. Members, members, this is not a marketplace, members. According to security analyst Ben Moki, the call for the removal of the contentious provisions in the act may not solve the security nightmare in the country as would an agreement of the differing parties. We shouldn't just say throw them out. We should have the, the, the parties, the stakeholders involved, whether it is court, whether it is jubilee, whether it is other people with the interest in the, in the, in the, in the amendments, sit down on a table, uh, uh, put apart all politics, and deliberate to come out with the best position for the country. Justice Udunga has now referred the case to Chief Justice Dr. Willie Mutunga to constitute a three-judge bench that will hear the matter. Reporting for WTV News, I am Oscar Kimani.